Okay, welcome to NOLA NOM. Part two, Snowball Edition. <laughs> My name is Angel Carter and I'm a Senior Admission Counselor and the Diversity and Access Coordinator in our office. My name is Bailey Gabrish. <laughs> <laughs> My name is Bailey Gabrish. I'm also a Senior Admission Counselor and the Architecture Liaison in our office. And I'm Sam Rich and I'm also a Senior Admission Counselor. <laughs> Alright y'all, so we're here at our first stop of the day at Plum Street. This is definitely the closest one to campus that we're going to go to today. They've got over 50 flavors here, but they're only open March through October. So you gotta get here while it's hot, literally. Um, so yeah, let's go see what they've got to offer. Alright y'all, what do you think? <laughs> really? Their ice is so good. It's such a good texture. Also, I don't know if you can see, but... <laughs> The snowballs come in these little big out carriers, so <laughs> you definitely get a good amount for your buck. Mm -hmm. Okay, for stop number two, we are going to Hansen's, um, which was founded in 1934 and is thought to be potentially the oldest snowball stand in the U.S. So let's go see what's up. What y'all think? Delicious. Mwah. Melty, mm -hmm. but the condensed smell really makes it. Being from Maryland, usually we put melted marshmallow on top of our snowballs, so this is definitely a step up. Mm -hmm. What did we think of Hanson's? I like the flavor of Hanson's. Like, I really enjoyed having both the watermelon and the ice cream flavoring. It really complemented each other a lot. I love Hanson's. It's just such a classic, like, New Orleans experience. I always love going there. Plus, yeah, the coffee flavor was just chef's kiss. It was so <laughs> good, and it wasn't too sweet either, which I love. Yeah, very crowded for a Thursday at noon. Yeah. yeah. People love them Hansons. Oh, yeah. Did it work it, work it, work it, work it, work it. We are on our way to our third stop of the day. Um, but while we're in the car ride, Sam, can you explain a little bit about the difference between a snowball and a snow cone? I sure can. So the difference between a snow cone and a snowball really lies in the difference between the consistency of the ice. So in a snow cone, the ice is like a little bit bigger. It's kind of crunchy, a little granular. Um, but in a snowball, the ice is a lot finer. It's like really, really fluffy. Um, so also because of like the ice consistency difference, in a snow cone, the flavor, like the syrup, just basically sinks to the bottom. So you kind of got to like slurp it through a straw. But in a snowball, because the ice is so fine, it actually like absorbs the flavor. So while you're eating the ice, you get a lot more of the flavor. Delicious. There you have it, folks. Delicious. <laughs> What's up, everybody? We're in our third stop here for Nola Noms over here at Sweet Bangs, which is actually black owned and women owned. So we're super excited. We heard that they have one of the most famous snowballs in form of a strawberry cheesecake snowball. So none of us have ever been here. We're super down to try. We can't wait to try all the flavors. fly on my shoulder okay all right y'all so we are still here at sweet fangs as you have seen before earlier in that video the size of these snowballs man they're huge but they're designer snowballs that's what they call them the one and only designer snowballs here at sweet fangs all right y'all so we've gone to all three places today honestly we are all sugared out for the day yeah. um, <laughs> but let's chat a little about each place what was y'all's favorite of all three. So Bailey, what? which one was your favorite? I'd say I have to keep my loyalty to Plum Street. Definitely a place I've been going since I was a freshman here at Tulane. And I just can't get enough of their snowballs. Oh yeah. Sam, what about you? I think I'm gonna have to go with Hanson's. Mm -hmm. That ice texture really just won me over. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What about you, Angel? Yeah, I'd go with Sweet Fangs. Mm -hmm. I mean, first of all, the title. Let's, <laughs> let's start there. So before you even get there, Sweet Fangs. But again, just the atmosphere and that vibe there, does not compare to, to any of the other places we've been. All right, y'all, that brings us to the end of our Nola Nam video. Thanks so much for watching, and we hope you join us for the next one. See y'all later. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Stuart, we can never eat this many snowballs again. Never. Please don't make us do this video. <laughs> the next time we do this series, we'd like chicken or something. <laughs>